They want to feel represented, seen in class. Fair enough ask, right? A group of BIPOC students in the Boulder Valley School District have been working for change for years now. The report on progress, here's Byron Reed. I think we just wanted to like show ever since he was in the seventh grade. It makes you feel like more connected. I feel like Isaiah Williams has been getting a lesson in patience. We had to just take deep breaths and just calm down and just keep going. I mean, we just had to keep going. Williams is one of five juniors at Centaurus High School who wanted to make a change in the classroom when it comes to race and culture. I think it's yeah important for that BIPOC students can have a voice and be feel represented and comfortable in their own schools. As like BIPOC students, we didn't feel represented in the school and we didn't really feel like we were learning about our own cultures and histories, which is not really the best feeling. The group wants to create a new ethnic studies course at their high school. It's a goal that has the support of the Boulder Valley School District. It's really going to be how the students want it to go for them um, with some educational parameters. but. They can design it. Lynn Gershman is the director of academic services for the district and is helping the students with the approval process. So we'll start with the Colorado State Standards. Um, we'll take a look at what standards we want to make sure that this course covers. Um, and then we'll start talking about the final product. What does that look like at the end of the course? How do we want to show what we've learned? She says it's her goal to have the class ready to launch the spring semester of next year and time for this group to take the class before they graduate. And they'll be the first group that takes it, tests the course out, and uh, hopefully it'll be great and we can keep going with it. Almost like a, like a really big like family, if you will. Yeah. These students hope the course will be offered throughout the district for years to come. Yeah. Like make everybody yeah. feel welcome there and like they can share their voices. So other students like Isaiah can learn the benefits of speaking up. We've been working on this for so long and now it's finally here. Um, makes me feel good. For next, makes me feel like people are finally listening to us. I'm Byron Reed. Students came up with the idea while working with CU School of Education's branch on public achievement. It's a group that encourages youth led civic engagement. I'd say it works.